This building was constructed in 1878, and it was originally constructed to honor the soldiers in the Civil War era. It's then used, obviously, because what the Grand Army of the Republic did is they also did a lot of charitable work taking care of the veterans and the widows and children of those men that fought in this war. When I look at downtown Aurora, this is definitely something that seemed to be one of the oldest sites, and it's also an absolutely beautiful building. It was quarried from limestone in the area when it was originally constructed, so I think it's very representative of what the city looked like and what was being done at the time. The original hall was built in 1877 when the cornerstone was laid and opened exactly one year later on July 4th, 1878. The hall was always meant to be a memorial to the veterans who fought in the latest war, which at that time was the Civil War. As the hall, we make sure that we open on Memorial Day to honor those, and we close our doors for the season on Veterans Day. I think it reminds us of how important the men who fought for this country and fought for our freedom are, and this is very representative of that.